Um, you know, when I got elected, I wanted to be on the Human Services Committee because I feel like I, I, I want to help people. And there's no doubt that every single person on this committee wants to help some people. And I, and I truly believe that. And I truly respect that. I believe it in everybody's heart in this committee. We all want to help. We all want to help people. Um, the, the, we may disagree on how to get there. And, and everybody has their own philosophy of how we're going to get there to help people. Um, and when I look at a bill, I, I kind of look at its process and, and kind of peel back the onion. I look at it as like an onion, and I, and I go through the layers. Um, you know, who, is it, who are we helping? Why are we helping? <coughs> Excuse me. What is the cost involved in it? And I also look at what are my fundamental beliefs. Is that the gov does the government or the state of Canada have the right, the fundamental right, to make decisions for us? So I, so I looked at this bill, and when I got to the first layer of the bill, I, I had a stop, and I really couldn't look any further because this particular bill would expand um, Husky and Medicaid coverages for children 19 and under that are illegal immigrants or undocumented immigrants, and that's where my level stopped at right there because I look at many families struggling today um, trying to make ends meet that are here legally. I look at the immigrants that came to this country, that they went through the process, they have children, they're working, and you know they are paying for their own Medi Medicare, or their own, obviously, um, <coughs> coverage. Seniors getting by every day, struggling to pay their medical bills, buy their grocery, groceries, even their electric bills. A and I believe that everybody wants to better themselves. Uh, and I think it's certainly a process. And I, it's unfortunate. I, I listened to the testimony of the woman there. It was really, it really was, you know, heartbreaking that her daughter has cerebral palsy. And and they're great people. But I truly believe in my heart that we have to come through this country, through the legal process, like everybody else has. Um, and I, I think that's really important. I, I have a hard time supporting something that's um, supporting language or expanding coverage to people and again they're great people they come here they want to make a better life for themselves that uh, there's absolutely no doubt about that but again they're here illegally and I, I really want them to go through the process to better yourself and then certainly at that point look at if you need help we're, so we're here to help we're here to help everybody like I said I believe everybody on this committee wants to help um, it's not that I'm not sensitive to that, but I truly believe that um, you should be a legal citizen in this country. Go through the process um, to get those benefits. So for that reason, uh, Madam Chair, I'll be voting no. Thank you very much.